My friend Zay Faidi, I work for Las Valle, which is a research and consultancy organization based in London. And I became interested in making money that bad. Years ago, when we started starting open manufacturing, and we were looking at how the making movement would have renewing the traditional manufacturing movement. Uh, together with colleagues uh, at the Plant Pumping Up Foundation, we forged uh, a report on open manufacturing, which then became uh, a basis for a CAPS project, which is about to start. And so we are looking at a new maker movement, uh, particularly from the point of view of how it could become a mainstream movement via um, collaboration with uh, manufacturers. I'm not an expert, so I don't have a lot of experience working with makers apart from what I've seen so far, but they tend to be a bit on their own, so there is not much collaboration uh, between makers and as they work on a project together, which is not very often the case. Uh, and there is not much collaboration even uh, within networks like Lots networks if they belong to different countries. So, of course, there is collaboration, but I think so much more could be done on this front. And in this sense, I think CAPS project can be uh, very helpful uh, putting together by design people belonging to different countries. Um, and I think governance, of course, could be a key issue that we need to hold and try to build uh, sustainability. My experience, we can do better uh, with collaboration and we can probably learn from past experience with so social innovation of experience to make for ourselves. I think, uh, uh, I mean, in fact, it's a uh, very important uh, issue for my organization. We work a lot on trying to assess and enhance possibly. From what I've seen and started so far, uh, I think the potential uh, in terms of making movement is huge. But, practically speaking, not much has been achieved yet. Mm -hmm. And that's because we are still in a very experimental stage, and also because of the lack of collaboration we already have in the before. Um, I think the impact of makers can be digging several fields from environmental sustainability to social inclusion, to collaboration, open source, uh, creating environment and life. But I think this will be achieved if we can achieve sustainability from an economic point of view, if we can build critical masses between makers, if we can open the movement to influences from other sectors like mainstream businesses or civil society organizations social economy or governments and uh, I think it would be very important to ask makers when they work on projects to monitor if they are achieving in order to scale it and also to embed it into their business models of the region. I think in the first place on the mapping they are doing, both of the case studies and uh, the different technologies which are used, uh, will help a lot with understanding the state of the art and mm -hmm. what's working and what's not, which also means that besides what your guys are going to do, which I'm sure will be great, all the broader community of perhaps people, social innovators in general, will have access to both results and will collaborate in order to reinforce what's working and overcome the issues which haven't been addressed so far. So I have great expectations on the outcomes of this project.